Hey guys, this is Magori, and welcome back to Lobotomy Corporation. Last time, we dealt with a puppy, and then now we're doing with a hanging puzzle thing, I guess. Um, a part of I sound a little bit more congested this time is just I woke up not too long ago, and usually I wake up with a little bit of congestion, but uh, hopefully that is not the case. Around 0 0115, unrecognizable objects resemble an umbilical cord and are messily scattered. Despite being a room where a baby resides, it's eerily quiet, devoid of any cries or whines. Whines or cries. Yikes. Neon Ellie takes a moment takes a moment away from the work and approaches 0 0115. Barely keeping a smile as to not alert the fetus. <laughs> You lied to me, honey. You're keeping a smile on your face. D021071 loves instinct work the most. Please don't do work other than instinct with him. Or else the Quip Off Counter has a medium probability of lowering. My work was that the Quip Off Counter decreased. Okay, not too bad. Oh! The information finally displayed for the things. Is so, Tef class. Channel views. When D zero two one oh seven escape, a voluntary return to this unit after attacking the point by taking from their corpse. Good. <laughs> um. All right. Combo of insight. Um. And then. Okay. It says attachment work is low, but it's replaced with commission. So cute! HP plus 4, success rate minus 2, and work speed minus 2. Um, oh. I mean, a lot of the ups that we've had are, um, a lot of the ups that we had are work speed and whatnot, so that's gonna be really interesting. I saw what happens when people go insane for real. <laughs> Which, we can get already. Not this given in a D, but it's Clip of Counter is at 3. It's weak to red damage, endured by white damage, normal by black damage, and then vulnerable to pale damage. Oh, your weapons are so cute! Uh, so pause. I don't have enough makeup though. Okay. Pod, let's go, girl. Let's go insane. Go insane. Alright, so... This little guy. A mysterious marble which hangs from the containment unit. Utilize the abnormality to fortify an eagle weapon. This will consume a small amount of the facility's currently collected energy. We know of an ancient practice of countless promises that were made and the unending faith ending uh, unending faith placed in them. The fortified weapon will have higher attack power. However, all that they yielded was only hollowness and betrayal. However, there is a possibility of losing the ego during the fortification process. So interesting. We have nine lob points this time, so I think it is time to hire another newbie. Um, we're gonna make this one. Um, uh, um, you know, I have a silly joke. One, 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 one. <laughs> Your name is this uh, agent uh, Uno. But I love it. Let's see what it's, uh, a <laughs> Um, yeah, Uno. Uh, okay, yeah, his name is Uno. Uh, <laughs> okay, your name is Uno. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 
That's up as, uh, fortitude a little bit. <laughs> oh, why am I laughing about this? Oh, Jesus. Um, I was born. Uh, yeah, you're moving down a level. Hope you're happy. Alright, so we got this little thing. This little thing is so sparkly. We got a puppy in the sparkly thing, and then you got terror bad things up there. Uh <laughs> Alright, what can we get now in this guy? We can get this. Oh. You have s Wait, you're... Magic Bolt is a wild class, and your Ego Suit is a key class. In interesting. Um, 50 law boxes! Holy hell! Um, let's see. Devil ultimately wished for despair. For despair wears wear down in the mine and drains one's will to go forward. When one feels there's nothing left to go for, their soul falls down to hell, the devil's domain. This, this is why the devil finds it more entertaining to watch people fall in despair rather than to simply kill them. We describe it as selling one soul to the devil. When a marksman has received a gun from the devil, the devil proposed a childish contract. The last bullet would puncture the head of his beloved. The moment he heard that, he sought and shot all the people he loved. Then he told the devil, this magical bullet can truly hit everyone, just like you say. With the last bullet gone for good, the huntsman traveled to numerous worlds. Sometimes he helped those in need or fought with evil. But it was all done on impulse, not just our goodwill or ideals. In one world, in one world he was a righteous hunter, but in while in another, he was a Wednesday gunman. One day, the marksman realized the devil no longer followed him. He pondered why, and then, then realized that his soul had already fallen to hell from the beginning. The contract had already been fulfilled, so the devil had left. The marksman, now the, a devil himself, continues to pull the trigger that gathers the souls of others, just like just as the devil said, the bullets can puncture anything for you, you please, forever. Wow. Interesting. Alright, let's see. It's so pretty! Oh, she's so happy. The desire to stockpile food for the coming winter. Her, chi her children are always hungry. So, the specimen we're doing is a her. Well, I've all of known before that it shouldn't be black. A water shadow begins to move. Spiders have much strong maternal instincts. They will defend their offspring at all costs. At times, a few spiderlings may fall from the ceiling, but everything will be fine if you just ignore them. I'll make sure it's not to forget, and uh, not to forget to gently give themselves a pat down before leaving. As to sure the no spiderlings are st are still clung to any piece of clothing. We got some law boxes on this guy at least. Employees with prudence level one squash their spiderlings. T zero two for free. Turn those who harm the children into cocoons. While cleaning the unit during a part and due to a part of while cleaning the unit due as a part of insight work, Tom was quickly turned into a cocoon by T zero two forty three. Jeez, oh yeah, so no insight work. Definitely do not insight work on that guy. <gasps> oh, Ellie, you got the puppy ears. Oh, you're so cute, Ellie. Oh, she's gonna be so happy when I show her this video and. She has a pup baby ears and speak gold. That's so cute. I don't know why, but like, dogs, like, I wouldn't, okay, I wouldn't necessarily take care of a dog. That's for sure. But dogs are just so cute. <laughs> and they're terrifying if you they run at you, but they're so cute. I'm, I'm the middleman of uh, cats are cute and then dogs are cute. Because uh, dogs are definitely cute. Uh, cats, I like them a lot, but I've been taking care of them to where they kind of like, uh, uh, well, sometimes like be an asshole to me, but you know, 
It is what it is. We need more stuff in the puppy. Well, I mean... Alright, we're good. And then... Oh. This other model was created by the ideas provided by Tumblebug backer Lee Yuhi. So this was made by a backer. A super fluffy ultra cute puppy with white fur with like fresh snow. This abnormality is so cute that just taking a short glance at it will make you feel so much better. His eyes of an angel and is the purest thing in the world. Further descriptions of this cute creature have been omitted for brevity's sake. The rest of the sentences are essentially just saying it's so cute in various ways. This abnormality couldn't be evil at all. The only thing you have to worry about is uh, about is your heart aching if you look at it too long because it's so cute. In fact, the animal am employees who enter this abnormality's containment unit tend to lose themselves a bit and often need to be forcibly removed from the unit by other employees. Caution needs to be taken by the assisting employees. Can also be captivated by its cuteness and become lost as well. Plus, attempts to bring the abnormality out of its unit may occur from time to time. But this is not a concern as they are typically prevented by other employees. When employees, when too many employees want to work on this MRI, a lottery will be held to decide who gets the privilege of, of doing so. <laughs> Our employees tend to show symptoms of mental regression, such as oddly toned speech, uh, with high pitch of and entering its containment unit, but it seems to be an only temporary problem. Plus, many of our employees refer to this abnormality as the goodest boy of in the world, Popa Day. However, its official designation is simply Popa Day. Make, be sure to make, uh, make please make sure you don't get uh, please make sure you don't get confused. Plus, 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 plus. Every employee who enters the containment unit must upload a video or photo report of this abnormality. This is highly, extremely, uber important. Ensure that nobody messes the step. A company of this size will always have a rumor of two or two floating around. I hear that you can hear someone's brains, uh, bones breaking if you walk the hall. Excuse me. I heard that you can hear someone's bones breaking if you walk the hallways at night. If you try to track down the sound, you'll find a yeti who's eating one of our employees. However, we don't have an abnormality that looks like a yeti. Excerpt from audio log. John, you should be thankful, dude. You get a lucky chance to work with the goodest boy of the world, Popa Day. Uh, it's babbling his jaw. It's bapping me with its paws. Is this an attack? He just wants you to feed him. Do you know what? That is a trend in our company to always carry a packet of dog food or two? Well, I really don't like animals. John lets out an entire irritated mumble. By the way, this little puppy is pretty beefy. Is this how dogs usually are? I guess this one's played a lot of catch, huh? We used to play fetch with him, uh, with him pretty often. Just to show, uh, just to watch how cute he was running after the ball. Though, we stopped for some reason. Hey, did you see his face when I fed it? It was super creepy, I swear. It's just your imagination, man. He's always our little entry. He's a good boy. He was a good boy. <laughs> Jeez, does this thing have some kind of power to mentally manipulate people? No idea what you're on about, Jacob. Do you want to be with you, boy? Real cute, boy. Do you, do you? <laughs> Did you wait for me, Papa Day Boy? Uh, hey, he's eating something. Aren't we supposed to be the first people to in its unit today? My little goody good good boy is is just hungry. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> man, he's just so cute. Look at, look at how he's gnawing on that. What the hell is he chewing on? Shit! I knew it. That's that's James' finger, man. He went missing during the last patrol ship. Can't you see the nail? Remember bragging about having a heart painted on it. Having a heart painted on his nails? I told you, dude. This thing's up to no good. I... I can't believe it. Who? This animal is a killer. I get that you're shocked, but I told you... I, I told you a bunch of times there's no way a cute pet could be harmless in this place. Man, I'm glad you finally came to your... Who... Who went feet on time? Poor little guy's been starving all night. It, it's so heartbreaking. Uh, well, I think we're supposed to suppress it. How could you even suggest doing something so heartless to a cute little boy who's like this? Just look at his eyes! How could an innocent animal get dumb if any from? Is that why you go, you will, cutie boy? The animal just shows no action. Only the sound of the bone being gnawed on is audible. Dude, 
Your little angel is gnawing on our colleague's finger. What are on a new what are you, a newbie? Don't you know everything cute is forgiven here? I never heard of that, and I seriously don't think it's true. We're gonna tranquilize it, and if you don't, then I'll do it myself. The sound of a tranquilizer shot can be fired it can be heard. No! <gasps> the animality begins to whimper. The recording sh cuts after a bit of shouting. Following the evidence I provided in the recording, I request that Jacob be immediately be immediately demanded for firing such a, a thing at Popa Day. A terrible, evil animal abuser who has no place working in, in our company. Our goodest boy in the world, Popa Day, has been traumatized. Traumatized! By this incident, he will only eat 5 kilograms of his favorite snack now. To help him cope with the trauma, I suggest we request a new snack for Popa Day. Premium grade salmon rich with vitamin B. I'll be waiting for a reply. <laughs> reply. Your requests have been accepted. P.S. In your next min uh, message, be sure that you attach 500 photos of the goodest boy in the world, Puppet Day. Thank you in advance. So, this thing is a puppy that lures people <laughs> into thinking that it's cute. <laughs> a cute, vicious little murderer. <laughs> Shit. That's not good either. Alright, what are you- what are you weak to? Normal, normal. Weak to black damage. Uh, okay. Nothing to worry about. Oh no, they're going other people. Max, what are you doing? Oh dear. Jesus. Good. Okay, that's gone. Dead. Ugh. I was worried we were like I was worried um how like we were gonna deal with him. That oh my god, that is such a relief. Um, your work time is a thirty. Um, here, let everyone heal up. Good. <gasps> we're almost there, people. We are almost there. Um, Bonka, and then um uh, Insight, Spark. Then, okay. I think we have this on lockdown. Am I allowed to make a good puppy? Okay, you're- This is endured- This is weak to white damage, endured to black damage, but in, vulnerable to pale damage. A lot of these seem to be vulnerable to pale da- <coughs> Pale damage? Excuse me. Um... I suppose Max can work on this for a little bit. Yes. A lot of people dead, but, um... Most of them are corks, so it, it shouldn't be a main worry, I don't think. I haven't you need to do something, bud. Okay, Popa Day is not that bad. Uh, it's only if the work result is bad. Almost there. We did it! We didn't complete any missions, but that's okay. Alright, your Olive's SP is up to 58, Ellie's is up to 68. Um. Ivan's prudence is up to 68. Uh, bon Bong's prudence is up to 48, and her justice is up to 21. Uh, Bonka has her tempera up to 41. Spark hat level leveled up level three, and his prudence is now at 48. Max is at 85 prudence this time. Wow. Okay, and then. Uno has his tempera up to 24. Okay. It took a lot longer than I thought. Oh! Wait, but it's day 15. Uh, okay. Alrighty then. Alright, what abnormalities do we got? We got 0155. Child of the Galaxy. Then 005. 76. Schadenfreude. Then 004. 84. Meat Lantern. So, oh, uh, we have different options this time. A teardrop fell from the child's dewy eyes. A star showered the sky. The world falls into a slumber trapped by a ecstatic lullaby. 
Someone's persistent gaze can be felt through the keyhole inside the machine. That's not a flower. Order all employees nearby to evacuate immediately. You know, I'm gonna take a bold choice. I don't know if this is gonna be annoying, but child of the galaxy. Did you hear the news manager? They said a rodent found its way into the appliance room, one of our facilities restricted areas. This could become a serious issue. Removing the rodent itself should not be much of a problem. However, its feces and the cables have been gnawed on, on and the cables they have gnawed on may damage the system. This is one of the reasons why we emphasize security so much. You would do the best to remember that. I will personally deal with the rodent this time. But if you happen to find any rodents, manager, please notify me immediately. Alright, so... Next time, we're gonna be dealing with, uh... Uh... I don't know what we're gonna be dealing with, but... See you guys then.